my name is Abbott. I'm an artist living in Portland, Maine. You can check out my work at abbott.com. I'm going to show you how to paint a realistic coral reef on canvas. So start out by creating your palette. So I'm going to squeeze out some red, some brown, some yellow ochre, and always make sure that you have some black and some white on your palette. And you can feel free to use green or blue or tan. Coral reefs really come in all sorts of colors, but I'm choosing to do kind of a stereotypical coral colored coral reef. So first I'm going to take a big brush, or medium to large brush like this one, and get it kind of saturated with water, and grab a little bit of white, a little bit of black, and a little bit of red to create a really pale, kind of grayish coral color. And I'm going to use this to sketch out the general shape of my coral reef on this canvas. That it's canvas set paper that I'm using, which is really just like canvas in paper form. So it's sort of like sketching out a tree. There's different branches coming off of the coral reef. There's some kind of low, squiggly pieces of coral in the coral reef. And then there's the area down at the bottom where it all gets kind of clustered together. So once I have my general outline sketched out with the big brush, I can start to go in with a smaller brush and add some darker and less watered down details. So in the big coral reef, I'm going to add some more red, blend in some yellow to get that kind of orangey coral color, some white for highlights. And right now it looks pretty abstract, but we're just going to keep building up and adding more and more details to the coral reef. And for this other part, I'm just going to do some streaky brush strokes. Then I'm going to take an even smaller brush, and for this part, I'm going to add some texture. Think about how in a piece of coral there's lots of little holes. And I'm going to add those by blotting down some black dots and then blurring those together with some red blotches. And this will just create that kind of spongy texture that you find in a coral reef. Go over that with some white just to kind of unify the whole thing. And then add some streaks of yellow to that other section. And then if you're painting a whole underwater scene, you can add blue, dark blue, or shades of green for the water. My name is Abbott and I just showed you how to paint a realistic coral reef.